I'll just do one more attempt. If I don't make any progress here, I'm just going to do um, something I didn't want to have to do and call it an early night so I can grind these guys. Crazy. That's what she said. Gotta Level grind these them guys. up. <laughs> we wanted to grind the guys. We hear all yeah. heard. <laughs> grind the guys. God Someone quit that, please. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Sang, get out of there. No shit, eighties. I love how it sounds as if you were just addressing the entirety of the 80s. I know you're addressing David. Oh, uh, fuck me. Oh! Well, if you insist, come here. <laughs> Let me tell after the stream is over. No. no. Right now. On your knees. Oh my god, what the um, fuck is that? Yes, no. Good boy. <laughs> That's a big boy. Also what she said. I have a railgun. <laughs> also what she said. My PP is bigger. <laughs> I have a rocket launcher, my PP is bigger. <laughs> made the right choice hey, coming here tonight. That yes. is the weapon psychology. Every time someone has ever wielded a rocket launcher at a young age, that was the thought that Come on, came in their Get head. out of there. Nick, game. Game. Clock second hand. Huh. God damn it. Nope. Son of a bitch. God damn it. No. Damn it, no. 
items. Curves man. Alright. Second hand's pointed at 30. So that's the second hand. Son of a bitch. Sound like you're in an interstate tunnel, whoever's doing that. Yeah, I'm doing that too. <laughs> Taco's just cruising down the interstate, tuning into the live stream, <laughs> weaving through the mountains. Don't worry about it, but I'm just curious what the sound is. Oh, no. The sound? Yes. It's spooky. Damn it, no. Well, I am assuming oh, you're. Oh, you guys must mean the highway. Uh, yeah, I... sorry about that. Uh, there's a highway not far from where I live, so. Oh. Aeon was right on. I, I still I still prefer the idea of cr like you're cruising around on the highway in the back seat of a car going like, hey guys, I'm in the live street. Cruising on down Main Street. Moving around at the speed of ground. <laughs> nope. It would be like the intro to uh, that movie, what's it called, uh, Night Drive? God damn I need to see that movie. No, um... About a week ago, I, I was on a road trip with my family, and I got to listen to The Midnight on a Thunderstorm in the backseat of a car while high. It was yeah, the best yeah. road trip ever. You had me until Thunderstorm. No, it wasn't like a spooky one, it just made the sky look pretty. Yeah, you had me till Thunderstorm. I will I will hold you and keep you safe, love. Yeah. Hmm. Aww. Is that sweet in the deal? Hmm, maybe. <laughs> that clock has no minute hand. It's never pointing to the right time anyway. I mean, if it does, we have ice cream. Ice cream? Yeah, ice cream. Although ice cream is a food, I will accept this. Yeah. Because it is a dessert. Come on the road trip. I will snuggle you through the thunderstorm. I will do many t things to you through the thunderstorm if you're holding me. Mm -hmm. well, I welcome these things. Mm -hmm. Step one: freaking hold me during a thunderstorm. <laughs> yeah, I'll get you down here yeah. then. Mm -hmm. Oh God. At this point, yeah, there's no point in fighting these guys. <clears throat> I haven't seen any girls here. Might want to check the top of this building. I haven't seen any girls here. <laughs> I haven't seen any chicks. Oh, okay. I love how his immediate first <laughs> winter is to the roof. It's just like, yeah, there's no girls here, but maybe one's about to jump, I don't God know. God damn it! Check the roof. <laughs> Welcome, check the roof. One of them might be trying oh, to do roofies. it for you. Roofies. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> that was a bit dark. Try the roofies. Okay. Oh, sip, sip. Trying the roofie.
Oh man. What are they all getting in line for? It's called being polite. God damn it. Uh, okay, it is not the whole, ho whole hotel that went out, it's just the main event space. Uh -huh. Son of a bitch. No, oh, it's those big guys. Come on, Cyan, run. Uh. Son of a bitch. I found the tank. Who's got a Molotov? Oh, Jesus. That's horrifying. The second hand on my watch is pointed at four. All right, so I'm guessing 4.30 so far. God damn it. I'm just gonna have to keep LNR just pressed down while playing this. Not just. Sure. Need to get used to wheeling the chair around my room. It's heavy and the carpet is thick. I must become stronger to move. You better so move much. it, move it. Huh? Do you say something in bread? I said you've got to move it, move Seven. it. Cyan, come on. Oh, I thought you said something in surrender. Never mind. What? Maurice, Maurice, I cannot move it, sounded, move it anymore. <laughs> it sounded like you were speaking in baguette. No. Si vous voulez que je parle, le français, je peux faire ça. Oh my god, that was fluent. I see you're trying to seduce Et me oui. now with your silly baguette bread talk. Peut-être. I'll have you know it's totally working, you snail-eating butter fuck. Snail eating butterfuck. <laughs> je ne mange pas ça, mais je pense que c'est bien, mais je ne sais pas. I don't know what you said, but I'll see you in because I'm turned on now. Excellent. It's <laughs> <laughs> all oh. part of the plan. <laughs> <laughs> all according to Kai Keku. <laughs> Every time I hear someone speak French, my immediate first thought is Wakfu. Is what? What? It's a... It's a, a French cartoon anime show thing. What's it called? <sighs> Wakfu. W-A-K-F-U. W-A-K-F-U. Wakfu. 
That sounds like some weird, like, Asian English parody. Hmm. Wakfu. I have not heard of this. It's, um... Okay, maybe it's the last one. But the reason I call it a French anime is because it's one of those anime that kind of pushes the line between anime and ecchi to the point where it's like, we can't tell Damn the difference it. anymore. Between anime and ecchi? Really? Anime. Yeah, like, there's... You know, some anime have that thing where, like, they kind of... They kind of push the boundary of fan Oh, yeah, he, like... he means edgy, not ecchi, sweetie. No, no, I know what ecchi is. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. He means edgy, as in, like, dark. No, like, no. I would be edge, oh, not that's... edgy. He means etchy as in, like, close to hentai. Cyan, come on. Oh, I yeah. The definition you gave a moment ago meshed edgy, not etchy. Sorry. Oh, sorry. No, I don't know what you said. No, no, um... I wasn't sure, but the definition you gave confused me. That is fair, that's my beat. No, it pushes the definition between, like, fan service, fan service, etchy, no, makes sense. He didn't mention that. He said push it just pushes a boundary in general, initially. At least that's what I heard. Yeah, I think... I probably misspoke. It's fine. But yeah, the, um... Uh-huh. But yeah, it's like... It's an interesting show. I like some of the concepts in it. It's... It's just a cool French anime. That's a little horny sometimes. Like you said, etchy. I will say... <laughs> there are some clips in the show itch. that are just horny. For the sake of horny, it's just like, I... God damn it. They could always, like, not do this. That'd be perfectly fine. Hands pointed at two. Oh, this is huge. Actually, something funny I remember about Wakfu. So, um, when I first found it, it there was a video on YouTube by the people who made the show talking about how, like, their crowdfunded English dub had been finished, or they were starting crowdfunding for an English dub for the show. And then I watched the English dub of the first season. Where did all the money go? Uh -oh. Because it certainly wasn't on voice talent. Um, sometimes that will change between seasons. It's like how when I show people Psychopaths, I notice that I only show them season one, and I never show them season two. Which, by the way, I have never even bothered to watch. Uh, fair. Not because the writing staff changed in the middle, and it went from a brilliant story to... A bunch of not terrible, but not brilliant writers being handed a brilliant story, so naturally they couldn't really keep it up. So it kind of shits on season one, which is why a common trend in Psychopaths is they make a lot of media that just kind of doesn't acknowledge season two, or doesn't require you to have watched it. <laughs> it's it's like, it, they like shadow banned it from its canon, if you know what I mean. Yeah. <laughs> We don't talk about season two. Yeah, literally. We don't talk about. Sorry. <laughs> uh... But yeah, no, I am. Um... Like all I know for sure is that apparently season three's English voice acting is leagues better than the first two seasons, and we haven't gotten English dub for season four yet because of course we fucking haven't. I'm not mad, it's fine. It's totally fine. It's cool. Cyan, come on, get out of there. I like that one Why John not? Tron meme. The one where it's kind of just like, I don't care, I don't even care. And the caption's like, I care immensely. Didn't I already... Yeah, I already looked through here. Damn it. Get 
kind of jazzy. Oh my god, get the fuck out of there. Another time. This is ridiculous.